using the X line command horizontal and vertical options so let's go and use the X line command we'll go up to the draw extended menu and then oops we'll go up to the draw extended menu and then we're going to hover and pick on the X line command and it says specify point or and then we have a horizontal or vertical option I'm going to click on horizontal and so specify point through. I can pick any point graphically. Uh, I'm going to key in 0 comma 0. And boom, it went right through 0 comma 0. And I could key in any other value. You know, I could key, key in 4 comma 0, etc. Or, you know, 0 comma 4 or whatever. But let's go now and try the same thing with a vertical. I'm going to go up to draw. I'm going to go to construction line and now this time I'm going to come down and choose the vertical option and it says specify the point and I can pick any point graphically or I can key in a point I'll go 0 comma 0 boom and now these lines these X lines go off into infinity in both directions and they're great for laying out construction lines so I'm going to place those on my construction line layer and if it's an architectural uh, type of a drawing we do a anno no plot and these help us block out geometry or rough in geometry so these are construction lines uh, geometry to build other geometry and so we have some good options to make sure that they're horizontal or vertical